Well, the Northland is facing a weird winter. That's right. Wildfire season usually starts around springtime, but due to the dry vegetation because of the lack of snow, officials say we could see the season start much earlier. And Northern News Now's Michaela Ranch tells us how early start could also pose an even greater threat for significant wildfires. According to the National Interagency Fire Center, most of Minnesota and all of northern Wisconsin is at an above normal potential for wildfires. We are the only part of the country with this distinction. According to the St. Louis County Emergency Management Team, a vast majority of these fires are caused by humans. Um, so you take your cigarette butt out the car window into the ditch, um, starting your grasses on the ditch and fire, on fire and then spreading into to woods or tree line. Um, could be from campfires, uh, not putting those out overnight or once you're, once you're leaving those. Some wildfires can't always be seen by the public eye. DNR spotter airplanes have a series of schedules they can fly to ensure they can get to a fire sooner than later. There might not be general public that is able to call into 911 if they see smoke or fire, but just seeing those smoke plumes from a distance with these spotter aircraft uh, and they can identify the location and maybe the severity of that fire pretty quickly. Although St. Louis County hasn't received any calls for major fires, they are always preparing for the next emergency. During this time last year, the community was preparing for a flooding compared to fires. It could rain 12 inches on us next week in 24 hours. It's happened before, it will happen again. Uh, so we're always looking at, a, at an all hazards approach uh, to our planning efforts. but. Um, yeah, it's it's very dry compared to last year. As for preventing a fire, Brinkman says now would be a great time to look around your property for dry debris. Look in your gutters and around your house, anywhere that could be a potential bed for embers to fall into. In Hermantown, Michaela Wrench, Northern News Now. Michaela, thank you. Now, according to the National Weather Service, this is the least amount of snow we've seen at this point in winter in recorded history. Adam, I know you've touched on this many times before. Without that snow, we really won't have a lot of moisture in our ground.